how Max Maxwell has been wrong all along about one deal away. The whole one deal away, blah, 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 one deal away. Is it truly one deal away? So basically in this video, This is Ola coming to you live from my Empire Pro Studios. On this episode, I want to show you how Max Maxwell has been wrong all along about one deal away. The whole one deal away, blah, 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 one deal away. Is it truly one deal away? So basically in this video, I have another video by the way you should watch where Brent Daniels, Brent Daniels from Wholesale Inc. Uh, visited uh, Max Maxwell in the studio for a podcast and they're talking about this one deal away stuff and uh, I think it He put him in his place, you know, and I kind of enjoyed it, but ultimately just understand that I respect these two guys uh, Absolute respect for them. They work hard for what they have the audience they have I enjoy watching their videos personally. I learn from them but um, you know my market here is a little bit different basically what i teach you is teach you the real deal i clarify a few things for you i give, i keep it real not to say they don't keep it real it's just that you need to understand have certain level of context to take it to this level that i'm going to share with you in this video or any of my 600 500 videos on this channel okay so let's get into it let's see what brent daniel and and uh, and max max or are talking about when it comes to one deal is it one is it truly one deal away let's find out speak to six to ten people that might be interested in some maybe consider an offer so yeah, yeah well the statistics show and and by the way this is from millions of points of data yeah like yeah i train just not pulling out of i yeah i train <laughs> i train the best of the best around the country making yeah. millions of calls yeah. right and typically you get one lead per 15 conversations mm -hmm. okay that's what you'll do. Somebody that's yes or maybe something that that's there. So you need to build up enough of those conversations to build a pipeline. Correct. And then from a pipeline, then things start rolling. But you need about ninety days, right? Yeah. It's different than marketing. Marketing is interesting because people when they when they call off of marketing or they fill in something online, their timeline idea. shorter, mm -hmm. right? When you're reaching out, when when Nicole, you and I are yeah. reaching out. They're not necessarily ready to pop right now. They 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 need a little bit of time or it's whatever. Nurturing. We catch them before they start making those calls to marketing. Correct. So there's an advantage, but it also takes some time. So follow up's important. And uh, so yeah, I mean it depends. Max, if you talk to a whole list of driving for dollars, right? We talk about Deal Machine, right? We both use it. Yep. I've got six people on it. You know, all connected, yep. right? The whole yep. deal, right? We download that list. We call that list. We're obsessed with that list. That list is the best besides explain why yeah, it's the best okay a couple different reasons one if it's if this property from a physical standpoint looks distressed the homeowner has to do one of two things they have to invest a ton of money into it which most don't have mm -hmm. to fix it up or they got to sell it as is right that's they, it they have to sell it as is this isn't you know the the new family is going to move in there with their dog and you know it's fha compliant no and most agents mm -hmm. will never, never list a property i used to be an agent you used to be an mm -hmm. agent i don't know if you're still licensed or not but the point is is as an agent you walk into a house that's a stress you get a call from a homeowner mm -hmm. they say hey i want to sell this house happy happy we're going on list appointment you walk over there you look all right so let's talk about this really quickly okay let's 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 first of all he said let me recap for you this is cold calling just cold calling he has to at least 15 contacts to create a lead 15 to create one lead okay so let's do that math real quickly you have to have 15 contacts to create a lead so you have at least and he said you have to give it 90 days to become a good lead something like that right so you are at least 15 contacts away from a deal okay all right so are you one deal away from changing your life i agree with that part okay i actually agree with that part now the question is how many how much work how much activities how much um how much um effort how much input as we call it in project management has to go into creating one deal that's the part we should get into we should talk about that i'm not saying he doesn't talk about that yeah, frankly he's doing vlogs for the most part i think vlogs and podcasts he can't tell you all of that in there so i have to give him that credit he's not going to tell you all that it takes to create a deal in one video or just youtube it's not going to happen you're going you're gonna to need to 
get into a course, get into a mentorship, coaching, and have some blinders on and focus, right? Now, with that being said, 15 calls, now one lead away. He didn't say one deal. He didn't say you make 15 calls and you become one deal. He didn't say none of that. He didn't say any of that, right? He said one lead, all right? So there's a few calls, or you wanna call them contacts, okay? Because call doesn't equal to contact, okay? You can make a call. That doesn't mean you spoke to someone else on the other line, right? So actually, he's talking about contact, right? 15 contacts before you can create a lead. And that means a lead you can follow up for the next 90 days, okay? And he said something about the keyword, pipeline. Building a pipeline with all these calls that you can follow up with for the next 90 days. Are we making sense? Is it making sense little by little? This is cold calling, okay? So I'm gonna give you an alternative in a second here, but this is just cold calling, right? So you're doing that all this while you're not making money. You're hoping that you make money all this while, even before this video, you probably thought, hey, I'm just gonna make one call, it becomes a lead. Or you're talking to someone on the phone and your anxiety goes up because you really feel like this may be the next deal, this may be the next deal because you're not thinking with a pipeline mindset. There's a pipeline mindset and there's a one call away or one deal away mindset. A one deal away mindset is actually accurate until you don't have the proper expectation of what it takes to create one deal. One lead, how many leads become a deal? That's another question that we need to know. That's something we need to know, right? Personally, for me, in my experience, probably another 15 leads will turn to a deal, okay? But how much work goes into creating one lead? Or how, many, how much work goes into following up with, that, with the leads that we have? How many times are you have, gonna have leads that actually was a deal and then the deal fell through, right? That's gonna happen too, right? That's the reality of this game. So how do you make how do you make this game make sense if you're gonna encounter all of this, right? How are you going to make this whole thing make sense? Now, they're talking about driving for dollars there. Before I get into the driving for dollars part, as a, as a, as a thing here, you should never be driving for dollars by yourself. If you stumble into this channel, you're forbidden from driving for dollars by yourself. Unless you're just about your way and you see something that looks like a deal, sure. Write down the address. But leaving your house to go drive for dollars, have other people do that for you. It's not worth your time, okay? Have other people do that for you. Get the enterprise level of the deal machine if you must. If you really trust the process that much, then scale up. If you, if you really believe in the process of driving dollars that much, scale up. Have other people do it for you. Have 200 people around the nation driving for dollars and then do more deals, okay? Now, that's driving for dollars. He mentioned something about why he thinks uh, driving for dollars or the lead from that is better. Because if a house is just dirty and it looks like it needs work, there are two reasons why they must sell. They have to sell assets. Just because somebody is selling assets, again, Brent, you're wrong on this one. Just because somebody is selling assets doesn't mean they're gonna sell to you at the price that's right or that you can create a deal from. It doesn't mean they're motivated. They're, I, I mean, if you talk to enough people, you know most people are not even motivated enough, regardless of the condition of the property. Now, the condition of the property can result in motivation, okay, but not the other way around. Uh, uh, the condition of the property does not always mean they're motivated enough. That's what I'm saying. Another reason why you need to, Brent is right about this one, you need to have a pipeline mindset. You need to be fueling and be adding more leads and more leads and additional data into your pipeline all the time. You need to have a process in place to work this data, a lot of data, not one deal away, not one data away, not one property away. No, it's not. One deal away does not equal to one property away. One deal away is tons of work that most human beings will never encounter, especially from an emotional and faith standpoint. This is gonna test your faith. That's why it's worth it, because you're gonna go through a process that most human beings don't go through, so you can make the amount of money that most human beings will never make. Do you understand that? So it's not free. People are gonna see your result at the end of it. It's gonna look like overnight success, but you know how much you went through in, in terms of perseverance, in terms of putting in the work, in terms of just waiting and waiting and getting rejection, a bunch of no's before you get to that yes. Are we making sense here? So am I saying these guys are wrong? No, 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 no. Ultimately, I'm not saying they're wrong, to be honest with you. I follow them, I respect them, and I think you should too. What I'm saying is here, Let's put things back into perspective. Let's put things back and let's focus here, right? It's gonna take some work, okay? But you can reduce the amount of work by understanding leverage. You need to 
understand leverage you need to understand internet marketing period you need to understand marketing you need to understand the pipeline mindset how can you fill more leads and data into your pipeline and grow it and use an automated process to continue to follow up with these people because now you know it's going to take a 90 days for any of those given leads for them if they have a chance of being a deal ever to even turn over it's going to take some time it's going to take some work this is a real business it's a real professional business it's going to take skill set you need to invest in yourself you need to learn this process okay so is it one deal away yes you're one deal away from changing your life is it really if you close one deal you make ten thousand dollars chances are your life is not changed yet you're gonna blow that money anyway but that's a different topic for another day i do think that once you close your first deal uh you you, you catch the bug you will never go back again now you know what to do what not to do but you're still going to learn a lot of lesson along the way one deal is not going to cut it you need more you need to think pipeline mindset all right with that being said i want you to go download this book right now smart real estate wholesaling we talk a lot about leverage in there just go to smartrealestatewholesaling.com and if you go there right now i'll give you a bonus book my, my newest book is called real estate money secret i'll give you that for free as well and um it's also available in our audiobook and in kindle and in paperback if you prefer to mark it up with markers like some of my some of my clients hopefully you've been enlightened and educated we'll see you on the next one and peace